Right, um... Hmm. How do I do this? Studio mode... I don't actually know what I'm doing. I don't remember what I was doing for the, um... Wait, I remember now. Okay, so... Sorry for the wait, guys! Let's try to start this damn stream! So, picking up where we left started, going straight into, uh... Streaming Guilty Gear after playing Cross Tag. Hopefully my sound audio is right, can you hear Hybrid kicking the ball? I'm just going to line up and spectate, and it's going to be Hybrid versus JD first match. Straight into it. You can see the brackets there, I'd love to have a look at it right now, but... Yeah. Sort of trying to remember what I'm doing here. Into the game. Alright, this is working, everything's good. Someone let me know if there are any audio issues. And I'm going to try and find myself a co-commentator. So hopefully JD gets on the cab soon. But in the meantime, while I'm waiting for a commentator, if anyone is going to want to commentate with me, Nope, JD's on the cab, so I can't switch back to show you guys the brackets, but let's go. Here we go. We got uh, JD playing Soul and Hybrid Defiant playing Raven. I'm gonna pull out my Twitch chat so I can see what you guys are watching. So I guys can't give you a preview of my uh, sick BAM overlays. They are actually not very good, but they look better than these pink and white squares. Oh my god, I... Alright. Here we go. So JD playing Soul. Nice start around, gets a far rest. Doesn't get anything off there, but it's no problem. She's already established that neutral in the beginning. Nice counter hit. Lee plays strong in neutral. Nice 2H, gets conversion, getting a little bit of excitement. Gets a big counter hit. Good burst by JD, because that was going to lead into something. But oh no, doesn't confirm off the counter hit gunflame. You gotta count you gotta get that confirmed. Counter hit gunflame leads into a ton of stuff for Soul. Nice bait, but no! A bit too antsy. Pressing that button a little bit too early, so she didn't get the full punish. But nice awareness of just getting away from that volcanic viper. Even if you don't get a full punish, your awareness in just letting them know it's not free, next time I'm gonna kill you for it. It might stop them from doing it again, and that's the advantage you need. Just that small little mental advantage. Nope, doesn't punish the Blitz with. Oh, glides right over to Grand Viper and taking the first round. And uh, Blackwind, I don't know where Audacity is. If you do know where he is, that would be nice. You could tell him that uh, I would like to him to commentate with me. But I'm sure he'll turn up sometime. Not challenging that Bandit Revolver. Raven is a character with slow normals, but I think his 4P is fast enough that he can challenge after the uh, Bandit Revolver, especially after the 5K nerf. Nope. If that was an anti-air command grab, that would have been big, but it was a bit too slow anyway. Oh, Tex get hit. Oh, that was a that was a messy round. But like not blocking after teching, it's kind of an interesting thing. Because, like, you still have te uh, involve, you just do tech and mesh buttons. So it is an option, but then you also just get hit by tech traps, or things you can't throw. If you just, like, tech and mesh uh, jump H. Ah, uh, sweep, counter hit. Don't get nothing. Not setting up the gunflame. Oh, gets a counter hit gunflame! No, doesn't get the fast deal! But it's okay, throws him in the corner, drops the combo. There's a sweep. Uh, the wit DP whiff into just mash throw. 
You know, if you're not clean on your punish, you're gonna get thrown. We'll try to go for a meaty command grab, but it's either one frame too late, but it looked like it was just too close in that little dead zone where you can't command grab them. Trying to bait a DP there, doesn't work, gets counter hit by the Bandit Bringer, doesn't get a conversion, that could have been a kill combo. Jump H, yeah, straight into the glide, nice, got some excitement bar right there. Good blitz, throws in the corner, what's the setup, oh no, that is not good. Getting hit by that tech button, just going back, trying to find the space. Sweet, yeah. No ball. Even though Raven's ball got changed, it's still nice just to prevent that option. Especially against Soul, if you just throw out a ball, if he does do DP, he will get counter hit by a ball. So even if you do get hit by a DP, you should still be pretty good. The Hybrid Defiant taking that first game. There we go, there's that ball, oh, nice sleep, a little bit of excitement gauge, gets hit by the far S, nice anti-air, oh, decent conversion, he doesn't tech, so you just run it all the way, just get that knockdown, all that excitement meter. Yep, gets in, good blocks, keeping the string safe, watching out for that mash DP. A nice answer to the Grand Viper. I really like how instead of just committing to a glide, you just tried to go for the uh, just a quick fall and just interrupt the Grand Viper. But it did get bursted. I don't really agree with that burst. When you're really far behind, you really want to burst in a situation where you really feel like you have a chance to take the round. It's better to just give up a round and burst at the start of the next round sometimes. Especially when you're really far down. Oh, no punish. Big! Good burst, because that was going to lead into something. The waste of 50 meter for JD, and a waste of a burst for Hybrid Defiant, but you know, you keep the HP, and that's really important. Good blitz. Back to the neutral. Oh no. Does get the optimum conversion from that. Yeah, build that red. Looking happy. But unfortunately, you know, that's grey life. What you actually have is no life. Even a jab would kill you at that point. Oh no, he gets caught jumping off Fafnir, close enough to combo, but he doesn't combo off of it. Weak punish on the burst, but it's no problem. Gets another counter hit off the Gunflame, but he doesn't get a full combo. Does not respect the boar. Definitely does not respect the neutral. It's Grand Viper. Not sure what that red RC is. Great idea on you wild throw, but it didn't get the, uh, it wasn't close enough to beat up the Blitz. Nice anti -air. Come on, right stomp. Is it gonna be the first time? No, just hit the frame trap. Oh no, doesn't get the conversion, that board just ruining it like a Jacko minion. Nice anti-air. Not getting a counter hit, so you can't really confirm. But it's no problem, you just get the hit. Oh, Riot Stomp right into the ball. I think that was the first Riot Stomp. Doesn't get a conversion, he gets punished for it, just going for a risky move.
Oh, that's a full screen right stop. Nice block. Didn't get the anti air. Heads in with the counter hit dust. But the full screen Grand Viper. Oh my gosh, he's still living on that one bar. Is he gonna punish? Oh my gosh, the double blitz, but not enough meter. And JD takes it. Here we go, coming in for the match round for JD. Again, the Grand Viper! Wow, command grab straight through to Grand Viper. Good burst by JD, goes into the Dragon End store. What's he gonna do? No command grab. Oh, risky DP, is he gonna get the punish? No, not an optimum punish. It's not fishing for that knockdown. Here we go, Dragon Stalls run out. No punish, but he just gets a hit. Yeah, gets the low. Overhead. Nice place on the dust. Counter hit needle, but doesn't get anything off it. You gotta just go for the one hit straight into that knockdown from the scratch. It's very hard to get a weird conversion that kind of distance. A bit too early on that wild throw. Nice air grab. What's he gonna do? What's the Oki option? It's a delay low. Oh my gosh, look at that hit stop. You can get anything off there. Like anything just cancelled into an air command grab would have just worked. First mounted Grand Viper, gets a double throw, and takes it over JT 2-1. So in the meantime, I'm going to try and find out who's playing next. I think it would be Blackwind versus Daybest. I might miss the first round, but I'll be back quick. And I am back. Now, both of these players, they're just ready to go. Okay, now I figure out how to chat to them. Just go. Uh. Right, so day best versus Blackwind. Here we go. So day best, uh, Jaddy's Prodigy, and up and, up and coming versus Blackwind, the winner of the so far I think the last four tournaments. Good throw on that drill. Blackwind's bike is 
playing very defensively. I think he's just waiting to get him, kill himself. Uh, waiting for Daybest to kill himself. Okay, and uh... Radio, and I think joining me on mic is gonna be Audacity, who's finally got back from uh, playing Dota. Yeah, I can't hear you, buddy. So in the meantime, I'm gonna sort of work out those stream issues after this match. Got that uh, Faust. Yeah, big Faust. Gets him with the overhead. I really don't know what Faust does. Gets him out of the parry. No, he doesn't get a full combo from that. Yeah, it looks like Blackland's just scrambling. He just wants to get that last hit. Yeah, just goes for a jab. Okay. That sounded great. So yes, um, hopefully getting my shit together after playing X Tag. I'm kind of really disorganized right now. But yes, Faust is a character who has big normals. He wants to play the neutral game. So he's gonna use big buttons like um. I know, just far S, jump page, a lot of that stuff. Whoa, and no idea what's going on there. That's um, Audacity. I think something's whack with my Discord. So maybe that's on my end. Yeah, sorry for that guys, I'm just trying to work out some technical issues from this side. But uh, yeah. Blackland just, he's just going in. He's giving zero respect on Dave's uh, ability to keep him out with his normals. Yes, yes thank you. Hadassity did get hit by the Helium Balloon, and Blackwind got hit by a bomb. So... I, that was a that was a rough game all around. I think that's two games already to Blackwind. Oh no, that was the first game. That was that one win. Or is that two? Pretty sure it's two. They hopped off the cow. I definitely saw two there. So that was a two zero. <clears throat> Apologies for that. If you can see my Discord that in there in the background, I was just trying to sort out stuff. But in the meantime, let's try and, try and figure out who's playing the next match. And I'm gonna cut out the audio for a second while we try and figure out. Wait, that sounded like a keyboard. That sound. There it is. There it is. It's working now. What's up? Yo. Okay. And now you're in, and everything sounds great. So now I think our next match. Hopefully, it's gonna be crazy diamond. Or is Seraph versus Master Abi playing yet? Okay, I'll better figure out. Uh, Seraph's in the tournament? Yeah, Seraph's in the tournament. Uh, I don't actually even know if he's there. <laughs> he might be. Um... It's GG. Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't know who's actually playing. I don't know who's playing or not. But uh, in the meantime, um, we'll see if Crazy Diamond and Owlet are playing.
I'm trying I really to want to watch uh, Black Wind versus TT Kinetic. I don't want to miss that game. We get that on stream. Yeah, we'll get that on stream. We'll wait for him. Um... Yeah, I think that's, that's already random. like pretty late. I can't ping fast enough. Nah, actually, we'll, 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 should we put him on stream? I think that actually sounds like a great match to put on stream. Which one? Uh, Blackwind versus TT Kinetic. Yes. Uh, I think Hybrid's gonna help sort out Owlet. Uh, Crazy Diamond's restarting his router, so we'll be waiting for a second, waiting for the next game. In the meantime... And I, I was not prepared. I was... Like, playing cross-tag. That game is whack. Oh, yeah? Was that today? Like, did it get released? Oh, the beta? Yeah, I, I, I literally downloaded it uh, at 6.45, and I've been playing it for the last 45 minutes. PM? Yeah. Oh, okay, 45 minutes, yeah. <laughs> what do you think? It's interesting. Very I don't early have reaction? Um, I, I think chicken block is, like, broken. You can air block yeah. everything except DPs, and DPs don't do. Uh, they only do red damage. I don't do like so, gray life. So you're not taking real damage. You can like just tag out and heal all the damage you take from DPs, and it gives you a hard knockdown. That's it. There's no combos from getting caught chicken blocking. What about um? So wait, there's no like F there's no like FD equivalent or barrier right in that game, or is there? Was that? Sorry. Is there like FD slash barrier in that game? No, 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 there isn't. You just straight up block um, any normals on the so ground. So when you when you block when you're blocking in the air, you just block everything, including ground moves, right? Yeah, yeah. You just block whatever you want except come um, DPs. The P, uh, there's a universal DP button, and right. it just give, it does like one thousand damage. That's like seven percent of your life bar. Uh, that sounds pretty crazy. That's not a lot. It just gives you a hard knockdown. That's it. Yeah, just just the fact that everything you can block in the air. Yeah, it's it it seems pretty strong. Mm. Uh, I'm trying to figure out what's going on with stream. I don't know who's playing now. Uh, Blackwind versus... I think it's just Blackwind versus TT Kinetic just hopping on straight away. Okay, Blackwind versus TT Kinetic, then we just go to all the other matches possible. That's fine. Oh boy. Okay. And Vikings. This is a bit of whack. But that's no problem. Uh, I don't have to update... I only need to update one yeah. name. Okay, Blackwind versus TT Kinetic, and then we'll just check out all the other matches. Seraph's already beaten up Master Arby. I would like to see Seraph versus the winner of Aerobius and Forte, which just finished. Uh, Seraph versus Forte. Forte's just beaten Aerobius. Uh, so in the meantime... Let's go, Forte. Good. And then we'll check out some of the losers brackets. So he gets yeah, in, it's gonna get the knockdown. Crazy for, um... There's like nothing Viking can do. Just throw a lot of chains to cover dash-ins and hope for the best. Do that, yeah, that's pretty good. But kind of like, Johnny's a character where like, you're just hitting her from half screen away. Even if she counters, you don't care because you're gatling into the next move, which just kills her. Yeah. yeah I, Cause that's what I've found when I play Dizzy against Biken is that you're sitting half screen and then you trigger a counter and there's no reason to be scared. Mm. And that was crazy. He triggers counter and he's still able to block. So he gets the super, what's he gonna do? Yeah, throw, blow up that blitz, no problem.
Nice combo. He probably should have kept his level 3 and just done a air combo into the corner. Good conversion of Tatami. Doesn't kill though. But like, yeah, no problem. Just get a counter hit. Easy. Round 1. Blackwind. Right, start a round 2. Let's see what TT Kinetic's got. Oh my god, just grabs him out of that 6k. Yeah, just push into the corner, finds his way out, but he gets anti ed so here we go. Drops the combo, doesn't get the knockdown, he just Tex gets that jump H. That Tatami pressure, looking at his frame traps, finds his gap. That is... Oh, that is interesting, that is not punishable? Uh, the super? Yeah, oh no no, the um, the... Mistfinder, the uh, TK Mistfinder in the air. Uh, no, I don't think so, yeah, I think you're fine. Oh wow. Wasn't fast enough for that link apparently. Going for those frame traps. Ooh. Oh there's yeah, a Tatami he blows up this way. I feel like it yeah. You'll see when you see someone mid animation during the YR Sleep Flash, you should just block. Mm. Oh that's good. That's our Drop first game. From TT Kinetic results in the Black Wind clutching the victory. <laughs> Round shot 6p. Let's go. Ooh. Doesn't block the burst. I feel like he should have been able to block it there. I think avoidance he's the, playing pretty uh, smart now. He he doesn't yeah. want to really be in a range where Bi uh, Biking can challenge him, but you know Blackman just forces his way in with that just air dash jump S. Jump S is that little spiky mace, right? Yeah. That's that is one, yeah. that is a really good button. Yeah, it is really good. Like, this is his dash. I think. Uh, your black wind there, you gotta wait a little bit before you burst because you know stuff like that does happen. That, there's no way he could have got like a knockdown there. He's doing his instant dash of timing a little too early, maybe not used to Johnny's wake up timing. He uses 100% of his bar on the way YRCs that end up being red Roman cancels. <laughs> All air normals are unblockable. I'm mean, all ground normals are unblockable in the air, right? Without FD. Yeah. So even jabs. Well, there's a couple of exceptions, but yeah. Oh, oh my God. God. He multi threw over. Away. He threw that round away from drop combos like at least three times, I think. He's going for uh, when he gets like an air series uh, after like a level two P misfinder. He's going for. Uh, JP first. I think you should be going just straight JK. It's just some like some Johnny combo character specific stuff. A good chain pressure. Oh, nice counter hit. I mean, it's a black beat combo. Like sometimes it's just that little one frame gap where you didn't tech. And you know, you just miss the mashing window. Yep. So Blackwind takes that 2 0 over TT Kinetic. And let's see who's playing next. Mashing out a chain definitely isn't super easy. Alright, let's. Uh, we got uh, Robius versus 4. Oh, wait, no, it's not Robius. Uh, Seraph versus Forte next. <coughs> oh my good. Smash up. Oh my gosh, just look at all these triangles. <laughs> I've just got like orange and yellow triangles all over the place. Well, I'm excited about this uh, Seraph Slayer, which I've seen like twice in my life. He's playing Slayer. Oh, oh my <laughs> god. 
And I'll show you. I, I've this. never seen this. It I know Seraph plays a ton of characters. <laughs> oh my god, started around his backdash into Mappa. Fishing for that 6p. Like, as a melee player, you'd be absolutely terrified to get counter hit. We can yeah. see, like, Forte is just playing so careful. He does not want to eat a counter hit anything. Because I think that's just going to be the end of him. Is, I think this oh. is supposed to be one of Melia's uh, worst matchups. Just because yeah. of the backdash and the backdash and cancels. And the huge rewards off everything. Because you just see, like, he backdashed out of disc and then just jumped out, no problem. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh, drop the combo. Nice backdash, but uh, he's still getting frame shaft here. That should have come, but I don't know what happened then. There's some not clean Oki there. That's overhead. Ah, uh, gets caught oh, trying to blitz. Oh, but he's got GC. Again, trying to combos. blitz. Doesn't work twice, you know, you just got your Rage Burst and it's going, oh, they blow up my re reversal. Top. Oh my gosh, there it is. Oh, Drops he it. Wrong, he did the wrong one, I think. Blitz back. Burst out, he wants this round! That's a cross up! He has a cross That's up. a cross up! I say, yeah. Hey, that move. <laughs> oh, just gets the bunker. Ah, calls out that gap, nice IB. Oh, that was a. Blitz three. back. Yeah, just eat the blitz. I don't think he actually had enough meter until he got hit by the blitz. The throw. Is he gonna do a backdash? No, no, he just gets hit. Oh, just like six edge or something there, I think. Rather than just two edge, maybe. <laughs> He's just fishing. Nice command throw. Oh, doesn't get the combo. I don't think Melia is one of the characters that can get comboed from the command throw. Because it doesn't work on every character, does it? What was that? The um the Slayer command throw into a 5k uh mapper. Oh uh, yeah, I think that's like a true combo on like two or three characters. I'm not hundred percent sure. I know it works on like Zardo. But it's also uh, the thing where you're not mashing hard enough, so it's just gonna yeah, be a real yeah. combo anyway. Yes, right, yeah. Oh, uh, there's a power bunker. I uh, see. Yeah, burst there, you're not <laughs> That round was pretty much over if you didn't burst. Good throw. What's the Oki situation? Goes for the low. Nice blocks on the overhead. Puts himself in a corner. Oh no, he throws him. He dropped the pin though. Didn't get a chance to pick up the pin. There it is. Grabs a pin. Frame trap. Just the bait. Oh my gosh. Was that a backdash cancel into a mapper just to challenge the negative frames? Yeah, that's that's this character in a nutshell. Like you think the character's negative, but then you just get a backdash cancelled. Or you get uh uh oh, yeah. decide he decides just not to blow up that secret garden. Like that was a prime end of round material right there. He had to meet her too, he could have oh. just like like dead on time and just like, there it is, dead on time. Oh He's dead. <laughs> He missed the disc. <laughs> it's 6 <eight. laughs> Oh my god. I'm just gonna go like, Forte is not playing clean right now, and this could just be due to just not net crispy. play lag. Not very crispy. Yeah. I've definitely seen this man when he's playing crispy, and it's it's pretty hot, but that was not very crispy. That was like the uh, the discount KFC day, where everything's just undercooked yeah. and terrible. When you ask for crispy chicken, and it's not crispy. It's all like soft and undercooked and just makes you feel bad afterwards. Alright, we got this coming up. I I believe we're gonna play uh the loose bracket, so it's just showing up the loose bracket to everyone. I'm tr hopefully I think Arobius and Didi are already playing. There's not much to go by. I think we're going uh Sheffy G versus is waiting for the loser of Crazy Diamond and Owlet.
but I have no idea whether they're playing or not. Uh, I'm not sure if Windows has fought against Adam yet. I haven't seen DD play in ages. Not since like last band. So I... Not really sure. I think we're waiting for Crazy Diamond who's just been hit by the uh the Gosford hole. So his internet just got like stolen by druggies or something. I haven't actually played any Dota yet. I just came home and bought the uh, Battle Pass and... Uh... Dude, what's in the Compendium this year? Um, they added this... Um, yeah, I, I told you about it on Discord, like the role, role queue. So you can select a role uh, you want to play before you queue. And it sort of assigns you to that. So you can pick if you want to play support or not. <laughs> but that doesn't actually t uh, affect what you're doing in game. Uh, no, yeah, you can still pick any hero you want. Yeah, in any fucking role. And okay, then though. you get into the game, you'd be like, "Yo, that pause five, like." But you don't like you don't have to do it. You can just like do the regular queue. I think. I think it's okay. I think it's a pretty good idea. Okay, so Crazy Diamond, uh, he he seems like he has internet now. Cool. And figure out who's up next. I I really have. Oh, he beat uh, Alet, I guess. So Alet versus Sheffy, I guess. Awesome. So I like Alet as a player. He's a dizzy player, and he has oh, some Alec. really nice setups and like just understanding of situations. I always get really poor connection to him. I wonder where he's from. I believe last I recall, he was from Western Australia, so that might be why. Western Australia. All right, so Arabius is in here, but uh. We're waiting for Alet to get into the stream room because it's going to be Alet versus Sheffy G. Not sure why Robius is hopping on the cab, but uh, he should probably get off. Well, it's Robius versus TT. Uh, um... That's a game. That's in the bracket. Yeah, but we're gonna get through most of the the lower parts for losers first, so get the other sides of the bracket progressing. Yeah. Well, no, that they're in losers too. Oh, do you mean the other side is the other side? Of yeah, sorry. Okay. Yeah, because they're pretty. Uh, they're a bit higher up in the bracket, so we wanna try and even out the uh, bracket, so get these matches moving, get them completed in a tiny timely manner, so I can go back to playing cross tap. I don't think I've seen this guy before. Jermaine. This is going to be uh, Sheffy G. I've actually never seen this name before, so he might be a new player. Or he might be a professional. Well, look, you know, the start of round 6P against the start of round 6H, I think we're going to be seeing something really nice here. Great knockdown, lost his setup, just goes for a medi low. Oh no, drops a confirm. Ah, calls out the gap. Like, ah, I like it. You're pressing buttons against Dizzy. You're scaring her. Dizzy's not a high HP character. Definitely oh my not. gosh, and there's yeah. a... There is the stun. Ooh. This guy's a professional. Pretty, uh, standard start around Power Walker. Oh, nice tech buttons. I don't know what's going to get a full combo. 
Great cross up. Does it get the knocked fire out? Combo. The fire combo. Yeah, the fire combo. The one, the one mix up I know. <laughs> the one mix up you do. <laughs> it works, <laughs> man. I tried to go for air throw, but I didn't get it. This setup's so good. Low, empty jump. Oh, map is out. It gets punished for it. Oh, nice confirm. Nice. Bubble blow up. Bubble yeah. Boy. Just stay full screen, like, don't risk it. He's having so much trouble getting in right now. Oh, he's in. He finds the overhead. Yeah. This crazy setup. Just keeping it safe, oh. but he challenges that plus one frame. That close S is plus one. Oh, can't mash that up. There we go, the fire reset up, get the cross up from the uh, laser fish. It's the only one thing I can do. And the thing about that fire pillar combo is it's really weird because the fire actually. It's not consistent in the um, active frames. It starts off low and then goes higher. So if they're yeah. too high, you don't actually combo easy. Ah, oh, calls out the dash forward, so Al takes Calls that first out. game. Yeah. Air dash back, air dash forward, busy special. Unreactable. That was attempt to throw. Tries for a frame trap, but he actually hit the blow. Stays on the same side. I'm gonna instant block these mappers. Pretty sure Dizzy would get punished. Dizzy? Not really. Like, her punishes against Slayer yeah, stuff is not that great. You sure? On an instant yeah. block mapper? Uh, instant block mapper, mapper, yeah, she yeah. definitely can. She'd get like 5k far S into 2D. Or just yeah, farm yeah. 5k 2D, and that just starts for Rocky. Yep. Yeah. Which is pretty great. But I know so when you, you start uh, normal Slayer blocking. Hit, uh, yeah, when you start normal blocking, you start to have a rough time because your far S, your longest range normal, is not too good to just challenge him. Well, your 2k, that's like a pretty god button in this matchup. We've got him in a corner, yeah. Yeah, you just sit outside that bliss range, just wait for it to come out, and then just kill it. Like if he's insta blocking those, I mean, he would get so much more. Punish that? No burst yet. Maybe not gonna burst this round. Good frame trap. Ooh, yeah, I don't like that approach. Oh, wow. Damn, he gets thrown. <laughs> Forward thrown. Oh, that's not good. That's a lot of HP yeah. gone. Like, Dizzy is also a really low HP character. Ed Ash is a bit too hot. Early. Oh no, here we go. What's the mix up? Cross Doesn't up. block the cross up. Yeah, you can cross up a lot. Yeah, he's yeah. still on box on the. Uh, the fake over, uh, fake cross up. Nice combo. FD, oh my god. Oh no, you don't punish it. That is a prime moment to just win the game off that. It's no problem. Finds another hit, puts him in a corner, wants to knock down. Yeah, he's not going to backdash cancel the fish there. Great combo, right. keep it simple. Gets it done, gets it done. Roast sim. So Alet takes it up and loses, going to fight Rindos next. In the meantime, we have hopefully Seraph versus Chunich, which would be Adam. Uh, Maybe we'll see some more Slayer. Yeah.
So we've got some bunch of people just waiting around the room. So hopefully we can get our Seraph in here. Oh, Alit is actually from Victoria. Oh yeah? Yeah. But uh, man, this is like Australian net play. You can't tell. You try and kind of guess how far away they are from the delay you have, but you realize they can be sitting next door and you'd still get like yeah. 10 frames if you're unlucky. Uh, how many people do we have in this room? One, two, three, four, five, six. I think six. Uh, I think I gotta add Adam on stream, uh, on Steam, and then figure out how to invite him. I think. Oh no! Wait, he's found it. He's in. All right, so awesome. We got Seraph versus Adam. Yeah. Playing, is he playing Slayer. He's not switching characters, is he? He's gonna sit down. Yeah, he's gonna sit down. Look at that one bar and two bar connection I have to him. Um, I'm on four G, but I got this two is... bar to Adam, three bar to Sheriff. <laughs> this is might not be pretty. I feel like these guys are not gonna have that great a connection. Playing Slayer. So yes, I think that's our lag wizard in chat with the uh, glorious NZ Fiber Master Race. New Zealand does have amazing internet. I am sad we don't. Oh my gosh, that was a really nice whiff punish. Let's get the full combo off of it, though. I feel like Johnny's 2S just makes this matchup so bad for Slayer. It reaches so far and just cuts it's out a lot of good. stuff. Yeah. He's got that level 2 charge. Yeah, doesn't know how to play the Slayer. <laughs> <laughs> He's probably just like lab the 6D counter hit combo and be like, I want to play this character. Yeah. <laughs> Ugh, that's no good start. Nice counter hit. That's not, that wasn't even real combo, it wasn't blocking, oh. but it gets a raw 6T. Level 3 stocked up, any hit, any confirm. Yeah, just fishing for a hit, yeah. There we go, Miss Finer. Yeah, the Wasp Lat. Some levels, level 2. A lot just of red there. Low. Playing it safe, like he's just keeping really far away, just waiting for Slay to kill himself. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Yeah. That was a really good PRC because Adam looked really ready to punish that there. Alright, here we go, what can he do? Yeah, he's got the Slayer combo. Power bunker. Knock down. What's he gonna do? Wake up. He's gonna get hit. Uh, <laughs> oh, he 6 P's right through it. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> and here's him with the frame trap. Let's go. Damn, he tries to. Oh, yeah, that's good best. Bunker. Can you get one hit here? Yeah. Whoa. Nice was that level? That was a level three, wasn't it? That was definitely yeah. a miss import. He let it rip yeah. like that. That it's is because the uh, he tried to do sway blast it. When you get crossed, like when they cross under below you, it sort of fucks up your input and gives you misfinder. That's no problem. He gets another hit with it. Level 2, no coins. Misses the... Mapper, yeah, red RC. Puts him into the corner. No, he doesn't finish the full combo. Oh, oh he doesn't uh, punish that miss final whiff and he gets thrown for it. Robbery. Uh, I think Seraph did pretty well for... You know when, like, the they do something and you just don't expect it to happen, but you try and punish it and you're just too slow, so you just get one frame thrown? Yeah. That's exactly what happened there. It's the classic. The rematch. He believes in his Slayer. I don't. 
You do better if I'm better at it. Get level 3. Oh, he doesn't get a combo. Oh wow, that's 6p. <laughs> he just yeah. wants to get the counter yeah. hit. He's been doing it so much. Nice overhead by yeah. Adam. Yeah, level 2. Pretty good against yeah, Johnny's buttons, actually. There's a lot of Johnny's buttons. His pokes are high. Like, uh... 5k and 5s, uh, quite high. And actually, even Johnny's 2s will get counter hit by uh, Slayer 6p. Falcon. Counter hit. <laughs> That's number 6p! What the hell? Should have been a counter hit. Yeah, but he's getting counter hit. All those times he was fishing for a 6p trying to get a counter hit. Adam's making up for it because he just got like 5 counter hits in a row. And now we get the overhead miss finder. He drops a combo though. Oh, it is Good throw. Yep. It's at level two, but like that tech button from Seraph. Oh, this is gonna be big. Got the combo, another coin, yeah, he's gonna go for the knockdown. Nice, it's the full combo. That's a level 3. Optimal combo, well, sort of optimal combo this. Oh, calls out it! Oh, double oh, bait! Yeah, you can't burst there, that's like a desperation burst when you're just entirely screwed. Yeah, you can't really do anything. The second he got hit from his, uh, right, his dead angle, way. he was pretty much dead. There was no best point. So, Adam takes it over Seraph, 2-0, and now we're back to the lobby, and the next match is going to be... Hopefully Llewellyn versus... Slayer does not prevail. Roboforte and Hybrid, who are playing on another cab right now. He's hiding his tech for BAM, that's what Seraph's doing. He's making, he's convincing everyone that he's a Slayer player, which he is. He's yeah, he's convincing man. everyone that he's gonna 6p so much on Wake Up, but then he just starts doing like other wacky stuff like backdash cancel power bunker instead or something. Yep. So now we're just waiting on Hybrid Defiant versus Roboforte. These two? Uh, let's go. I really like Llewellyn. His ram is... It's it's dirty. It reminds me of a certain New South Wales player, actually. <laughs> Pretty much... I don't know, I think they play very similar. No, no. I think the difference is yeah, that Llewellyn yeah. actually has a setup. I mean, that, that's maybe the biggest had, difference. Maybe had setups. Maybe had setups. I don't believe in his setups. <laughs> I think they're, they're still pretty. They're okay. P P P P P. Corner, not good. 
Instant yeah. buffs, but nothing there, yeah. Definitely not good, because now it just got opened up. Gets a full combo, great burst. Yeah, I'm gonna get put into the blender. The ram blender's really good. It nice blitz out. Pretty amazing. No wall spot. It's fine. Oh, pin YRC. It's about. You gotta get out of the corner. Ram's like so scary in the corner. Everything just yeah. goes into a wall splat, into a full combo, into some kind of dirty setup. Yep. Just like that. 50 50, 50, 50, 50. The second you burst, the second you, there's a gap, like you get your ass out of there. You do not want to be burst, anywhere near. When you burst, the swords are still there, so she just bursts and then recovers and puts the swords back. And I think a couple of characters can actually like get out of the corner without being hit by the swords. It's pretty stupid. Again, in the corner. This is bad. This is scary. Damn. Great throw oh. punish. Yeah, the problem with Raven oh, committing goodness, too early to the jump H is that you can't Gatling from jump H, so... Oh yeah, unblock, you're pretty much screwed the second you land. Ah, uh, danger time. I would have liked to see... I, I'm not really sure that Raven can actually get a launcher from danger time into the air command grab. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if she Yeah, actually that's one thing that AB can't do. He can't do that combo consistently. <laughs> in the world, it's pretty consistent. Oh my gosh, that was a big counter hit. Yeah. Good back dash. He actually only got scratched by the sword and he just teched out. So... Well, Wallen wasn't really expecting that. Nice confirm to the scratch. Puts him in a corner. Finds his way out. Did she first hit the far S? No, no Dalu. Oh no, you get hit by the overhead, here we go. The blender, great burst, get out of there. Ah, oh, back in the blender, look at all those swords. Yeah, looking pretty dire right now. Sword set up. Oh, this is the JD. Oh, that still works. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Oh, it's a nice idea, but yeah, yeah, it doesn't work. I think that's... is that Raven's 6H? Maybe? Uh, yeah, that was the 6H. Yeah. It's good against throws, buttons, but yeah, obviously still gonna get bit by invincible reversals. But if you time it better and just get a more media setup with it, you can actually get out, because it just puts oh, Raven yeah. really high. Against Ram's DP in that situation, would have just probably gone it. right underneath. Yeah. So in the meantime, we got um. Rindo's a sporter. Yeah. Rindo's playing uh, Soul. Yeah. Now, I hear Rindo's a really strong Soul player. Yeah, really good. I think, I think Forte told me he not remembers this. Okay, that must be one of his moments where he was feeling some real crispy. Like, all those yeah. gun flames? He's getting real crisp oh, up. He's lost pin now. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, this is not good. Yeah. What's he gonna... Oh. Just gets right. a throw. It's too far. <laughs> no problem. He does the right combo to carry to the other side of the screen. Gets his pin back. That wasn't a good trade. I like that combo. Just trying to bait out a burst there. Yeah, burst there. But you know, four days not falling for it. Oh, 6p that. You know. Nice combo. Oh, please finish this. Thank you. That was that was so that nice. Was so I love the uh, red RC conversion there. He realized, you know, this combo is not actually going to connect. I better, you know, actually make it connect. 
<laughs> but that was a terrible trade. That was in a really bad situation. Nice blocking. Finds his way out. Oh, nice. Oh, that geez. turbo force, oh, reacting to that deck with DP and just turbo falling straight to punish it was just so smart from Forte right now. He is feeling mega crisp. This is Forte at like a high level of crispiness. He doesn't not... even need, he doesn't need the, uh, what's he doing? <laughs> okay, he's not crisp. I don't know what he's doing. Okay, this is like 80% crisp. crisp. He's not finished cooking yet. He's not crisp. If he loses this round, officially uncrisp. Okay. Oh! Uh oh. He still got first. first. Oh god. <laughs> oh no! No, he is. He is. Like, he might be. He's too crisp now, man. He is charcoal. He's overcooked. No way. This is. This is choking. Choking Forte. Six. Oh my god. <laughs> you didn't even FD. Hey, anti-air! Oh no! Everything is just a burst bait from Rindos right oh, now. Yeah, the other guy, oh, he's not falling for it. He's not falling for any of these burst baits. But he is on a okay, yeah. massive HP disadvantage right now. I think that burst bait was a little too hard to come Do something, uh, Forte! You're gonna die if you just sit there. <laughs> oh god! Is it? Is he gonna show how crispy he really is right now? The comeback, yeah, this is. <laughs> this is where we see how crispy Forte really is. Okay, his pin's in a really bad spot. That burst is coming back for Hope. Oh, that oh. could have been thrown! That is too scary there! Watching out, doesn't want to get chip damage. We sent an FD meter, nice FDs! Yeah, that was an okay, but oh. <laughs> Just run up far S. That that was the uh the second chicken wing. We overcooked the first one, but uh the second chicken yeah. wing of Forte. Conversion. Uh, Overhead. I think he could have baited that there. I think he tried to. He does an option select, but uh it didn't work for him. Oh wow, that 2D just connecting from the furthest of ranges. That, that's classic Forte. He has all these option selects, but they never work when he tries to. <laughs> 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 this is why he's like Runus' number one fan, because that's the classic Runus. I've got all these like all this tech, all these options, but when I, but I keep messing them up whenever I try and do them. Yeah. Oh, misses the dash. Gets the pin there. Yeah, get the punish. I think he missed that over there. I think it didn't even connect, but he still got hit by the disc. Ooh. On the drop. Gets wild thrown. Stops the combo. Goes high. Ooh, double jump. Very unorthodox. But it works out. Goes for the 2S sort of reset with the internet. Oh no, that jump H was a bit too early. Oh my god. I had a classic frame trap. That was the first grade, I think. Look at the pin. What's that frozen in fear? Look at that risk gauge! He is going to get blown up. He He's is going to oh, get. Oh, that was a good, that was a good escape. Burn. Okay. Oh, okay, this is good. And he needs to get into the blender, drain out that risk. Oh no, oh. gets DP'd. But you know, it used up that risk. Oh, it's a ass out of bad revolver. Good frame trap. Ah, gets jumped out. 
Monkey S. First, this is tournament. Oh, it's a bit too early. The disc doesn't tournament absorb. Tournament life. Oh, yes. Cheating. Watch out for that DP. Yeah, keeping it safe. Like when you're on that low HP, it is just the risk reward for just mashing out a DP, especially against a character like Melia, who can't directly kill you off of it. Is so good. Yeah, this is good. Uh, he could have killed there with uh, the One silver. more blender? Oh, okay. it's the overhead! You see. I'll forgive Forte for that though. He, he barely built the meter, so it's, uh, probably couldn't have reacted. Alright, straight back into it. Oh, spooky six, six chairs. Yeah, here we go. Punish straight to the corner, into the blender. Is overhead. Burst out. Nice. Anti air. Oh, brilliant air throw. Off the way I see. Miss DPs. Oh, it misses the bandit. Uh, oh my gosh, that riot stomp! <laughs> trying to go for an effort here, but it's no yeah. problem. Gets another hit, yeah. easy. Yeah. Probably gonna punish for it as well. Dead here, for the super. Yep. Stuff. Alright, no, Forte, bring it back! Now this is set point. He tried to throw, but he messed up. <laughs> Run away from the disc! <laughs> or as Forte likes to say, I just like to throw him, I just like to show him the flash and then hit him with uh, five, 5 edge. I think he often select that. 6, 6k and you're fine. Good throw, good, good call out. Haha, <laughs> the turbo 4! Oh, yeah, great disrespect by Rindos. Just need to get one good hit here. Oh, oh doesn't it's so finish scary it? To jump out of it's so scary to try and jump out of bandit. Uh, bring her. I mean, whatever. Nice. Can't get a knockdown off that blow. Wow, it's not a problem. Off. He gets it's like a run under cross up, but he's getting hit by DPs all over the place. He is getting hit by DPs. Look. Ah, oh, the double jump E clash. Oh no, there's oh, mortal counters. The right up wild throw. <laughs> Calling out the respect. That scary danger time against Soul. This is so scary for Forte. One hit and he's dead. Yeah, oh, good confirm. Not really. He jumps, she jumps it. No, he doesn't get the dash. He gets caught out for it. It's not clean. Forte, no. Oh my god. Oh my god! <laughs> the PYLC frame trap, the slowdown! The slowdown. So Rindos takes that 2 1. Damn, that was, that was an ale biter. Alright, I think we're just gonna go. Uh, Crazy Diamond versus June each. So, yeah, Crazy Diamond versus Adam next. And hopefully that gets all the losers brackets playing. Run back. That's gonna be Blackwind and Rindos playing off stream, and then Seraph versus the winner of Llewellyn and TT Kinetic as well. Meanwhile, we're gonna be checking out this run back in the winner's bracket. A best of five. Winner's finals. We actually got like a ton of killers this tournament. Info is just net play stuff. Yeah. We have like Seraph, Rindos, Forte. Seraph playing his main. Playing Slayer, that's pretty scary. Dude, I was playing against uh, Seraph's Johnny. It, it's, I hate Johnny. But it's okay, it's I, I, I got one game out of ten. Or it might have been 15, but I'm gonna hold that. I'm gonna pop off that one game. And how many? Out of 15.
Okay. Was he getting bored? He might have been. Nice counter hit, Miss Fina, keeping it safe. Yeah, great burst bait. Start around. This is looking really bad for Crazy Diamond already. Yeah, that's level three. War splat. Here he goes. Is he gonna get the full combo from here? Is he gonna get the knockdown? No, two hits, seeking air tech, but doesn't want to air tech. I think pot air teching against a Johnny is just all around pretty bad for pot. I think. Oh, I still think he might want to air tech. Well, he's got the whole turn now, so this, this round is very hard to salvage. Just slide it. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> it's in! Oh, oh my I god, is this gonna work? This doesn't work, yeah, no. <laughs> that has upper and ball. Oh my gosh, he calls out the dash forward! There's a pot buster, here we go to Crazy Diamond to Risky. Oh, yes! <laughs> I'll see. Red RC combo, he oh drops it. God, oh no! Doing? Wake oh, up, God. level 3 miss, Fina. What a crazy round. I think it might be lagging too. Slide head's good. Boss jump. Him. There we go. Hot Buster. This man can't stop pop Ah, the frame traps! You scare him with the pot faster, now you start frame trapping him! Oh, that's 60 barely! Uh, he misses. was praying! He wanted it so that's, badly! It's the prey, yeah. Oh, it's gonna hit the robbery. Just... <laughs> oh, nice. The armor! Ten, Even level 3 doesn't go for the armor. Hammer 4! Counter hit flick. Yeah, Is he gonna get it? Yeah, slide head. Push him to the other side of the screen. Oh, yeah, that, that combo doesn't work. Yeah, stock up on those pencils. Pot's a very learned individual. Oh, okay, well, that's fine. Oh, he's almost, ca he's almost stunned. Oh, oh, kind of hit me, Adam takes that first game. Is this winners? This is this is the winners finals. This is actually a best of five. Uh, okay, cool. Straight to the second game. Gets the coin hit straight away. Gets that level two miss final. He drops the combo. That tech button, that tech jump. Hey, trades with the slide head. Pots in. What's he gonna do? Misses the meaty. Calls out the burst. Here we go. Level two. Gets the knockdown. Yep, yeah, one hit. Oh, that frame trap. That air dash. Gets the mix up. Ooh. Oh, tech forward into fro. I like that cancel. Oh, that was a bit of a wild pot buster there, being punished for it. It's opened up by the air dash. Drops the combo, but it's no problem. Oh no. Still in a good position though, a lot of HP. Pushes pop back in the corner. Counter hits him with the coin. Crazy Diamond looking a bit desperate here. A lot of desperation throws he's been punished for. It's not really working out for him. Guess the air dash doesn't get the full confirm, but he's still in a really good position. Keeping Crazy Diamond down. Oh no! He finds that one hit. Convert. Bunch of easy combos. Big damage. Great character. So that's two games to uh, Adam right now. Two games to tune each. Not looking as strong as he did last week. That's no problem. This is our Crazy Diamond. He's taking a risk. He's going to demoralize Adam now. We're going to run it back 3-2. 
some huge risks. He's a pretty crazy person. Yeah. Right. Oh no, gets great conversion. No, he doesn't finish it. There we go. Yeah, Finds the pot buster. Doesn't call out the back dash. I think he was trying to, but Adam's starting to do uh, back dash and then jump. That's going to get him out of the delay pot buster. Oh, great throw by Adam. There we go, he finds the Podbuster. This is a crazy Diamonds moment. This controlled situation gets to jump in. That backdash. Giving Tunis the uh, space he needs. Great blocking on the air dashes. Oh, this caused it. He's adapting. He's catching out um, those jump outs. Yeah, like a, a light jump in. It's really good against. Uh... Backdash wake One hits way, gets the hard knockdown. Here's that level 3 miss finer. This can be scary. Double YRC. Oh, Great burst punish, is this gonna kill? No, he has no coins. Nah, oh, big counter hit! <laughs> yeah, that's good. It's just it's tech? Scary. Just like that. Coin's really good at covering uh, the Tempkin backdash. Two hit. Late checkout's a good idea. It's it by the last overhead. This is not good. This is really not good for Risky. Can he run this back with so little HP? Is he gonna get the full conversion? He's gonna get the kill? Because he can kill from this. Yes! Takes it! Sending a message. Going to the grand finals. Yeah. Ending on a perfect. 3-0. Looks like he might have practiced his, uh... Uh, Potemkin combos since last week. That was strong, that was fast. I was hoping that would last a bit longer. So we can... Sorry, we can wait for those losers matches to progress. But, looks like we'll be waiting a bit. Alright, so it looks like Seraph and TT Kinetic haven't played yet, so they're going to be playing on stream next. While well, Blackwind and Rindos is playing off stream on another cab. So in the meantime, the preview of our brackets. Can't really show you because I haven't optimized this uh, screen scrolling, but uh, we got Crazy Diamond all the way waiting at the end. Waiting for these matches. We've got Seraph versus TD Kinetic. And they're going to play the winner of Blackwind and Rindos, who look like they've just finished. So that score is going to update. Meanwhile, Seraph and TT Kinetic are just going to jump on this cap. Oh, we'll find out who the winner of that is flex. after this. Who's he playing? Uh, he's making some tough decisions here. Ah, uh, legendary Seraph Oh no. A Faust? I mean, I shouldn't be surprised, but a Faust? This Faust is not bad. I'll give it, uh, I'll pay it a little bit of respect. More respect than his layout deserves. 
Oh my gosh, counter hit by Fares, started round. He's still in a good situation though, TT Connect already wastes his burst. He doesn't have any misfighters stocked up though. So Seraph is actually still in a really good position. Oh my gosh, he gets to hook. Big boy combo. <laughs> hit by the bomb, that's a ton of damage. Yeah. Gets that drill. The stab, it's, it's... He's hit him like three times with the stab already. Look at that pressure. Gets hit by the coin. He's got a level 2 stocked up, so TT Kinetic, he can run this back pretty well if he gets a good hit. And he puts him into the Johnny Blender. But Seraph is doing a really good job at just pressuring, kicking it out. Nice PO by RC. Covering those gaps, but he finds the right hit, doesn't get the conversion. Oh, trades if they're going my way. He's so scared, so little HP. When you're on so little HP, it restricts your options so much. And just going for a desperate YRC there. Start of round 5D? I think he was baiting another Far S. As this is turning out really well for TT Kinetic. Gets that level 2 misfire anti air, but he drops the combo. No problem, calls out the wake up 6P. That's a little weird. Look at that, that 6H pressure. That natural burst bait, like you can't burst against Johnny, and this is really bad, he's paying for it. Again, that 6H pressure. Catching him, just trying to jump out. Oh, nice. the bomb, the conversion! Bomb. Level 2, just walks face first into a coin. Oh yeah, 6k is not quite going to get you under that. Oh, poison's really good here. Haha, <laughs> the blitz back. Fast, 5k. Amazing anti -air. The lag. Ah, the net play. Nice conversion. Yeah. Takes that first game. Sarah's Faust is actually looking really strong right now. He's keeping him flustered. He's keeping him out. He's throwing out those long-range normals. And Kinetic is just seeming like he has a really tough time on how to deal with this. Changing his start around to just a 5p, just slapping him out of the dash forward. Oh no, doesn't matter. I think he started the wrong combo there as well. Against this character, you also want to start with JK rather than JP, I think. Blitz back. Uh, oh, the full blitz. I think you just block it. You block it or you do tablets. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of just blitzing on Oki. Just so. Level 2 miss funnel, yep, burst out, don't let him get the full conversion. Play YRC's in, there's that pressure, jumps out, finds a gap. Ah, nice anti air. Doesn't get the conversion though, he needs to get the knockdown. Seraph is just teching, he's pressing buttons, he's putting so much oh, pressure by just having those <laughs> hitboxes out. Here we go, small fouls, is that safe? Yes, he yeah, goes he right is. underneath! There's still that mini fouls! <laughs> He tries his way over the mini Faust, but he goes right into the big Faust. Yep, giving him so much room to move backwards. Gets tagged by the pole. That pole is doing so much work in this matchup. Yeah, it's really good. Catches all the dash forward approach. Yeah, it takes him to the other corner. Oh no, he drops the combo! Yeah, sure yeah, set that pressure. 
<laughs> right over the hammer. That was so scary. If Seraph takes it over Kinetic, 2-0. That was such a scary thing to just press Jump H in that situation. Because Jump H's hitbox is actually pretty high up, and getting a counter hit on a tall character like Johnny, it, that was pretty, pretty good read. So now we got Seraph versus Blackwind. This is still top four, this is going to be playing for top four. Top four. So yeah, this is their loser semifinals. Right, so we're waiting for Blackwind right now. Don't know where he went. Sheriff disappeared as well, probably doing a restart. Classic Crazy Diamond pops on, on Planets. Yeah, Crazy Diamond is going to be the Oh yeah, we're playing. <laughs> Alright, Black wins in. Sheriff in. I'll cancel again. But in the meantime, we got a we got a show match going on right here. Audacity Milia versus Crazy Diamond Pot. Yeah, uh -oh. counter hit. <laughs> <laughs> Big counter hit. Big problems. Oh, look at that stagger. Those frame traps. Seen it safe. Oh my gosh, the reverse Mega Fist! <laughs> the conversion! The reads! Sheriff is in! And we're ending this early. We did not want to see how that one was going to end. Uh, that, was, that was pretty dumb. <laughs> I mean, it worked, and if it works, you can't call it dumb. <laughs> so, Seraph going back to character select. Blackwind pulling out his Leo, not his Viking. Oh my gosh, did he? Oh, he's gonna show Risky how it's done. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Sheriff Ademkin, this is his what, third character this tournament so far? <laughs> yeah. Sheriff Ademkin uh, is, uh. I think it's. Oh, I don't know. I haven't seen this character for a long time. Is it, that's the FAB color, isn't it? Yeah, of course. I feel like Blackwind knows how to play against Pot, though. I actually yeah, I think good. I actually would be surprised if Sheriff won this. You know, he's already got one Podbuster. Good throw by Blackwind. Yeah, use that 5k. Don't get hit by a wake up Podbuster. Didn't come out, but you know, you gotta be scary. Nice block. I would have really liked to just see him just throw there, though. It was in such a prime position to just throw him. Oh That's my really gosh. Calls really out it. Oh, he's not getting his timing right, so he's searching. The hammer for it, I'm gonna get the full combo. Oh, that was such a prime moment to just pop bust through him.
Here we go. Right. Yep, that 5k probably calling out a pot buster right there. See the overhead. Great air throw. Mm. When he blocks the sweep, I think he can pop buster that. I'm not sure. Ooh, Great counter. Right. Yep. Strengthens that super. Ton of damage even on pot. Backdash Whoa. pot buster. The classic. Oh, Does he know the combo? Yep. Heat knuckle. Yeah. <laughs> he does the combo that Risky has failed literally every single time <laughs> in the past two tournaments. <laughs> oh my gosh. He calls out the jump out. Nice. He's getting that. He's getting that IB like a lot, which is crazy. Start a round mega fist. Oh my gosh, the fire S counter hit. Yeah, Stop him from approaching. Using that TP. He's in. Yeah, knocked down. First out. Don't want to give Ali at a moment. Don't don't give him that. Uh, back turn 5k. You can't pot buster that. That's not a good time for pot. Oh, too far for the kit. But, uh, still gets the counter. Nice. Meter off this. And, wow, alright. Risky. Hope you're taking notes. <laughs> Hope you're taking notes. Seraph's showing you up, man. This guy's a... This is his second best character. Uh, Sarah's second best character after Slayer. I mean, we also got Kenneth in chat. You better take notes too. Every pot, take notes. Yep. Look at the real FAB right here. Look at that. Those reads, the counter hit on the far S. Oh, anti air. Oh, what's he doing? I don't know what he's doing. Oh, 5D. <laughs> He, he was going for that combo, the big dust combo. Yeah. Oh, just over into the S, man. Jumps out. Ooh, barely misses. Here we go to back 10. Yep, the 5k. Just, uh, yeah, do that. I don't, Dude, oh, that, that was so good! Such a great reaction! Air throw, oh, he jumps out! Just out of range of the air throw! Great confirm. Is it get back in? Oh, Backdash is over the slide head. Backdash on wake up, yeah. Okay. Nice jump. Just do the risky slide head YRC slide head. Oh no! no <laughs> he landed and that's tried to go risky. for a dust! <laughs> Who is this man? You do something mega huge on whiff and then you land and try and do a dust. But to be fair, Pot does recover in the air after a heavenly. Gets the hate knuckle. Yep, does the extend. Push into the corner. So scary. Is that punishable? I think it should have been. It probably should have been. Maybe. Finds his way in. Oh my gosh! Oh, it's a okay. counter hit! Doesn't get the cancel. He does hammer fall on Oki. <laughs> like a set prophet once told us to do. Like that? Hammer fall on Oki? <laughs> yeah. Do it again. No. Oh, just a fun day. That first DP. Oh, the back dash, the pot buster. <laughs> Seraph is on match point right now. He's so scared. He's playing his pressure so safe. He is too scared to commit, and he finds that far S. Safe first point. Doesn't want to get blown up. Oh, barely matches out. The risk is high. Oh, the Ooh, backdash, back pot dash. buster. Yep. Red RC, keep it safe. Gets a cross up, gets the overhead, gets convergence. Not gonna kill. Yes, no, yes. RC. You spend that meter. You you take no, that chance. 
One one. You do not give this man a chance to come back. Oh my gosh. What a start of round, straight into the 5P to heat knuckle. Here we go. Is he stunned? Yeah, yeah he is stunned. stunned. That's a great beat too. There's a blitz. Uh, that's good. 6H, good yeah. The big counter hit! He's gonna get stunned again. This is so scary for Blackwind right now. He's oh my oh, gosh, he doesn't block he it! Yeah. Calls out the yeah, cross through. Stunned still on the table, actually. Yeah, especially after this, Heat Knuckle. Combo here. Oh, wait. The oh, burst bait? Is that a stun? No? Red RC? Is this a stun? Or is it just gonna kill him? Oh, wow, these combos. Uh, it's like he's practiced it or something. Oh, wow. oh my gosh. Yeah, well, he's pulling attention to that one, Risky. He is pulling out all the stops to win this netplay tournament. He's saying, first this netplay tournament, next is BAM. You better watch out, man. This Seraph pot is going to take He's pulling out all his mains. <laughs> so we got Crazy Diamond just sitting there, his character shaking. Hopping back on the cab. There's no character select here. We are going straight into a pot mirror. Oh no, no, no pot mirror. Who will it be? He's probably seeing the random select button. In true New South Wales fashion, he's got a gacha his next character. Yep, yeah, gacha force in full effect. Look at that RNG straight onto a soul. That angry oh, face. Oh damn! This is his, this is one of his worst characters. Uh, yeah, I, I don't. I wouldn't believe this one. His Slayer's his best, followed closely by his Faust, then his Pot, then his legendary Zato. Are you stuck on please wait? I am stuck on please wait. I'm stuck on please wait. Uh, the game isn't allowing him to play Sol. He's saying you gotta take this netplay tournament seriously. You can't pick your terrible character like this. This is jeopardizing the integrity of the tournament right now. Yeah, Crazy Diamond sending a message. I will not stand for this. He is requesting a jewel. He wants that pot mirror match. Let me. Seraph calling out Oxus live on stream. That'll get their attention. Yeah, it is a really good, great game. Like, we should give so many props to Oxus right now. Great game, nice game. Thank you so uh, much. Absolutely perfect game. No technical issues whatsoever. I don't think they should have added the um, spectate a match while it's going on feature. I think that caused more problems than it, like it just caused too many problems. Like, I, think it's, I think it's a good idea in in theory, but it doesn't work that well. Yeah, that's true. Wow, now oh. insulting the commentators. Hold up, I hold up, man. I, I, I took, offended. I, I better take another game with my Dizzy. Maybe like one game out of 20 this time. But I'm gonna take that one game, I'm gonna run with it, Seraph. You better watch out. I'm gonna have to personally beat Seraph up after this match. Alright, the soul. I feel like Risky's never won a game in his life against Seraph Soul. 
Great air throw by Seraph. Gets that nice. 6p, that counter hit. Do you see? Oh Heaven God. leaves the wake up Riot Stomp! He knows <laughs> the bust is coming. Seraph's giggling right now, I bet. He's giggling as hard as he Wake up 6h, oh my gosh! <laughs> he tries the heat knuckle to tech, but that delayed tech by Seraph goes right through it. Look at that flick, he's so scared! Oh no, he doesn't punish that IB on the banner revolver! Watching for his feet. Get, yeah. The only thing that's gonna get Seraph back in this game is more disrespect from him. Needs some crazy combo. And Ooh, definitely not that! Combo. A drop combo is yeah. not a crazy combo. Great throw by Crazy Diamond, just take forward, press that jump H. 6H, raw 6H, this is bad for Seraph right now. Ah, oh, that coverage. 2D, that space 2D. Walk backwards just so he doesn't get thrown by the pot buster. Frame traps not catching him. Oh, the back dash, but no throw. Backwards, Mega Fist. The IAD forward will catch him. Oh, there's dust there loops! So many dust! Taya! Taya! Good flick. <laughs> Slide oh, head! <laughs> what a thing to do in that kind of situation. Yeah, I don't know what the hell that was. Yeah, that was a good slide head. I like slide head off um, uh, Fire Edge. Makes it a lot harder to react to, I think. Great effort by Risky. Walks back. Doesn't oh punish the DP. God. They'll just free damage on the table. You've got to take it. Hot player missing their inputs. It's classic. Just lets him jump out. He, he is praying oh, to God yeah. right now. Yeah, he is crazy. telling God to just like fix his inputs. He wants to land a pot buster so badly. There's low. No, I see. He doesn't often select. He does the. No, he's doing forward 6. 6p and H. Maybe he's just pressing 6p. The flick is good. <laughs> the DP. Full <laughs> screen Grand yeah, Viper! Yeah. Look, okay, I think he went. Maximum disrespect mode. There was a lot of wake up riot stomps there and ending on a full screen Grand Viper. Mm. He, he can't play, he can't beat him playing legitimately, so he's got to go full disrespect. In those knockdown jump loops. The bust. Oh, the 6B. He's throwing out the 6Bs a lot today. He, he is praying so much. He wants them to hit so badly. And he's had yeah. a few hit. That was pretty good, but I mean, well, I think that must have been reaction, right? That Although definitely looked good. I don't know how reaction. you react to that. No, I think... Well, you can react. But, uh... Maybe that was just a raid. <laughs> Oh, Start of burst. round riot stomp! Yeah, well it beats, beats quite a few things I think. And flicks through the gun flame. First bait. No, it's not close enough to get the conversion. Great pot faster. This is the start. Well, Daphnia, yeah. No, doesn't doesn't uh, pick it up. Refuses to kill him.
<laughs> really? He cancels uh, yeah. his far S into a bandit bringer? Wow, the trade is the heat knuckle. Getting that slow dramatic four. Rich Green is playing so flustered right now. Like, Seraph is really just setting the pace. Mm. That is, uh... It's all really just like... Spam gun flames. Spam 2D, spam JH. It's really hard to approach. Finds that gap, gets the pot faster. This is his moment. DP <laughs> Red Heart Speed, no problem, just get out of there. Backdash is the pot faster. Ooh, oh, this is impeccable spacing, doing 6 hate just at a yeah. range where he won't get thrown. Really good <laughs> backwards Mega Fist. Butt slam. No burst. Alright. Takes around. Is this his moment? Is he gonna take it? On a 2 0 deficit, can he run this one all the way back? Ooh, the counter hit. This is juicy damage. Go straight into the super. Ah, the tech trap! Throw. Around. The match point for Saros. The stand there, press fire S twice, Grand Viper, what a confirm! Good confirm, yeah, good confirm. Yeah, Taya, Taya, Fafnir, Dust Loop combo, no problem. Oh, he drops it! Tech buttons, punishes him, puts him in a corner, he just jumps out! He's so scared! He's so scared of that DP Red Hussy. Uh, he takes that yeah. so solidly. We're gonna see Slayer again in the grand finals. I wonder. That that was brutal. <laughs> it was that was looking really tough for oh, crazy there. So now we got uh, Adam versus uh, Seraph. So Chin Eats versus Seraph. Oh my gosh, he's got zero bars. Now normally when you join a room, you start with four bars, don't you? And it just ticks down yeah. to whatever terribleness it is. You know, Adam's yeah, a hard worker. Really lagging. Oh, the juicy elf. I think this elf felt pretty good. I think it's slightly worse than Fairy's elf elf. Adam just resetting his router. We'll be back in a second. Or maybe maybe he saw the elf out and was so disgusted. That yeah, I, I wouldn't want to play. I would yeah. not want to play against someone with an elf out head who's playing elf out. Like, that's when you know that guy is, that guy is mega serious and you do not want to deal with that. So, while we're waiting, we got a little, uh, little example of that show. A little bit of an exhibition right here, waiting for Adam to reset his router. Now he's back. Oh, okay, so we ain't even starting. We just looking at this disgusting character and going straight to the lobby, going, "Yeah, you don't want to play against this." <laughs> straight in, yeah. Elf felt versus Johnny. Alright. That start around far S. A really bad burst, but it doesn't get punished. Get 
Gets the low, gets the knockdown. Lock that pine berry. Another knockdown. Getting him for those frame traps. Yep, catches him out of the air. That's gonna finish the combo. No, he drops it. He finds another hit. Just finding all these low hits on Adam on Wake Up. Two H is good. Yep, nice air dash. Nice burst bait. Doesn't get the full combo, but it's no problem. It's already taken like so much HP, but Seraph is fighting his way out. There's a pine berry. Okay. Calls out that gun approach. The fast slash is too juicy. Can't beat it. Unreactable. Yeah, overhead. Unreactable overhead. <laughs> Bridal Express YRC, just get yourself to the ground. <laughs> Going for the unblockable, who <laughs> just counter hits him. Yeah, unfortunately, he didn't check out there. Face the wall, go sit in the corner, Elfelt. Trades with the coin, not actually good for oh Elfelt here. God. That's 6k B grenade. Just fishing for those two H hits, just sliding forward. This is big for Adam, though. He gets the hard knockdown. There's the blitz. Good counter hit. Wow. Drops the combo. Not good. I'll convert off that. Nice. Good best way. Was that a fairy tech? Just tech forwards buttons into an like a red Roman cancel? <laughs> if that's what he did, it's a fairy tech. <laughs> fairy tech is tech forward YRC internet dash. <laughs> Kill you. Sarah of taking that it. first game. Fairy's tech out YRC is always go in like the perfect area where you, where your uh, anti air doesn't hit. <laughs> There you go, great burst bait. Doesn't get a full conversion off of it though. Yeah, two less counter hit, gets that miss finer. It's not charged up. Jumps into Ooh. the Bridal Express and he gets a full conversion. No, he doesn't. Ooh, Here we go, no, the Johnny just... Pressure. Calling out the back dash, but he doesn't get a full combo. So he just tech buttons, tech buttons, tech buttons. Should be able to kill here. Going for the minimum damage! Oh no, he drops the combo! <laughs> Bridal Express PYRC so now! Miss Finer. Controlling that neutral. I Let's give so it a one good. slap. Start of round 2H, right underneath the coin. Yeah. Beats, it beats coin, beats fast slash, I think. So I think it's a pretty good option. Oh, throw, throws him thing. out though. <laughs> oh, the two yeah, H going underneath. Great conversion gets to level two. No, he doesn't get it. Good back dash. Good check sir. No, the two hits doesn't get the hard knockdown. This is going to be bad for him. Trying to find his way to get pressure. Yes, gets to level two. The treasure hunter. Yep. Like, if you drop it at that point, that's gonna be really tough. Yeah, uh, and even he had burst, so I assume Seraph next. If he didn't die, that would burst. In the corner. Nice blocks on the mix-ups. But it's so much risk! Good burst! You don't want to take so much damage. But it doesn't matter. You eat a level 3 miss fighter. That is a lot of red gone. Drop the combo. Back to the neutral. Gets him with the far hitbox of 6p. <laughs> Counter hit Pineberry.
stutter out? Oh my gosh, was that? That was 6 H, yeah. yeah that is, fish. that is big. Oh, that was a yeah, lot of meter gone. Yeah, the dead angle doesn't even hit the fast dash. Finds his way in for Ned Ash. Level 2, yeah. Level 3 stopped up. Is this one? Yeah, it's gonna go for a knockdown. It's gonna use that on a big conversion. Good blocks. Good blocks. Oh no! He doesn't get the conversion off of it! <laughs> no problem, he catches him out of the air with a missed final. Damn. Really? Really, I felt. <laughs> I can't believe that 6p hit from that kind of range. Oh, he, he's going to return to the room. Oh, so he's a bit confused how many games I have to play, but uh, no, it's not it. It's 2-1, and we've got to play one more game. Oh, we're going straight in. I don't need to type anything. Seraph's done with the chance. Got to get that bracket reset, though. Oh. Look at that pressure. He's just locking him down in the corner. He finds that gap just to mash that 5H and then Adam's like, burst. I am not giving you this moment to do your Elfeldy things. These kinds of Elfeldy things. Get that close S, such a great answer, yeah. Yeah, Oh no, he drops it! The tech punish! This is bad for Adam right now. No meter. Yeah, right underneath the coin. Yeah, it's a good round start. Gets the counter hit. Have a pine berry. Hold that in the corner. Catch him jumping out. This is big. Here's a combo oh, shotgun, that's... shotgun. Those frame traps, calling out that mashing. Taking him to the corner, saying it's his turn. Let's catch him out, yep. Just trying to throw him back in. No, he throws him out of the corner. Back to the mid screen. Great throw by Adam. Oh, too close for that coin. Getting punished because he just crouches, goes right underneath it. That far slash. There we go, again, that fast flash! <laughs> Ooh, goes under with a 6k, but gets punished from the full down. That's now 2-2. Two, 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 two. Yeah, this is uh, Seraph's in a loser, Adam's in a winner. So if Seraph wins this one, he's gonna have to reset a bracket and then beat him another three games. Yeah. Oh, counter hit by throwing a pine berry at him? What is this neutral? What is with this character? Again, another pine berry hit, yeah. A close slash definitely gonna be six uh six K. This is big damage. Look at all that red. Yeah, he's gonna get the hard knockdown. No, he doesn't, uh, but he doesn't get punished for it. He's still got the corner pressure going on. Bunch of water meter there. Great count! 6k! Like, that was so good there. You can't go underneath them if they're in the corner. Like, you can't cross yourself up and just whiff. Great reset. There finds his way back in with the Fire S. Oh, that 5h going right underneath those shots.
Now this is actually going to be tournament point for Adam if he wins this. The Seraph needs to find his place. Oh, He's still yeah. gonna burst stocked up. He's not gonna have much HP left. He might not have a chance to burst. In a bad trade like that, he can't burst. But he gets the 6 speak out hit into the super, into the rocket launcher. Yes. Dead Oki. Oh, gets the count hit on the air hit. Get a hard Oki, gets the overhead. He's gonna get the full conversion. Don't drop the combo, you're one chance. No, oh. gets hit by the tech buttons. Tech Wow. <laughs> So close! Getting that 6 feet counter hit straight into the, uh, the super. Oh, he's running it back, but that tech button. It's the classic guilty gear. So Adam wins this tournament, 3-2. Dethroning Blackwind. For this, this week. Bunch of crazy players, crazy games he had. Thanks everyone for joining. So yeah, it's a preview of the brackets, guys, and I'll probably be uploading the VODs right after I turn the stream off. A lot of players this tournament. So thank you to everyone who joined. I believe next week might be Blaze Blue, or it might be delayed due to everyone going for BAM. We'll see what happens. But in the meantime, next Tuesday we're going to have our Bam seeding podcast on the Pitchy and Pals stream. Hoggers. So that's going to be Tuesday around 8 p.m. Eastern Sydney time. Uh, Eastern Australia time. Should be 8 p.m. I'm going to check a link in the uh, chat. Everyone bookmark this. That's going to be our Bam seeding podcast, where we all get to argue about who's going to be the number one player, who deserves their seeding, how rigged the brackets are, and why I can't attend morning pools, etc, etc, etc. And also, where Giuna is going to place and how he's going to ruin the brackets again. Oh, is Giuna coming? Yeah, Giuna has been confirmed coming. Um, I'm not sure if he's going to be caught up in commentary or he'll be actually be entering any of his games. That's what happened last time, wasn't it? He sort of entered Guilty Gear and... Blaze Blue, but he didn't end up playing because he was stuck doing Street Fighter Five. Yeah, commentary. yeah. So hopefully he uh, gets a chance to play if he really wants to play. Maybe yeah. Uh, I would I would uh, bet on him playing if he uh, if he has commentary duties. Yeah, but in the meantime, I'll catch everyone on their Pitchies and Pal stream once again. Thank you all for watching. Bye bye. <laughs>